Hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. Hi. How you doing? What is going? There we go. All right, I guess my laptop is gonna not work tonight. So we're gonna do it this way. Oh my gosh. What not is what naughty again. What the heck? All right, guys, hang on. I'm trying to get this going. Oh, well, I think, yeah, I've heard it's been pretty bad. I was in a live earlier and uh, somebody's giveaways kept running. Um, it was like, whatnot was automatically running them as soon as they started. Oh, it was, it was uh, a mess. So hopefully we can get through tonight because I have a lot of stuff I need to get rid of as usual, per usual. Let's make sure our YouTube is up and running. Hey, Lori, how you doing? All right. So evidently I, I had scheduled the live for uh, 5.30 instead of 6.30, which I, I, and I didn't realize it until I went in to postpone the live because I was running late and then realized that the show had already passed. And so I had to move one of my sh later shows up uh, but we're, we're up and running now. So hopefully, uh, whatnot is not going to be too glitchy tonight. All right. Whatnot is running. YouTube is running. We are almost set. I had a good day volunteering today. Sold a little bit of jewelry today. So already made some money. Can't complain about making money before I even start working, huh? <laughs> Took some uh, more jewelry to my mom. I'll have new jewelry. I'll have some new jewelry tomorrow night. Not new jewelry, but new to us. Uh, newly sorted. And then I just pick some uh, jewelry, some pieces up from my uh, jewelry guy today. So I picked up some sterling. So I have some sterling silver for us. Some interesting pieces. But those will be on tomorrow night. Hey, Tag Lady Tagalong, how you doing? Jesse Bell, welcome in. Good to see you all. Upcycle assemblage. I'm going to go in and look. When's your next live? I think I bookmarked it already. I did. I just did. Got it. I'll make sure I go in and uh, add it to my calendar after uh, the live today. You're welcome. 
This is going to be our Gibby. Kathy's Gift Shop. Hey, Kathy. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. I just came on and we are just getting started. This is our uh, opening Gibby. Everybody make sure you uh, give Kathy's Gift Shop a follow. I will do the same. She is a self-taught artist that's been making heartfelt gifts for over 20 years. She has a little bit of this and a little bit of that. She has a 5.0 rating and she has one day shipping time. So give her a follow. You're welcome. Oh, hey, Jesse, Jessa. I, I remember your show. Hey, Snoopy, congratulations. You changed your name, honey? I'm following you. I got gotcha. you. Where are you at? Uh, let's see. Oh, you have 946 followers. Woo, how exciting. I think I might have gotten my package from you, my gift from you today, um, but I haven't opened any of my packages. Um, I got home and I had so many packages. So I had packages delivered yesterday, but I didn't get to the mailbox because you know they have like the our mailbox and then they have the se separate package locker. So when I got home today, I stopped so I could get my packages out. And when I opened my mailbox to get the package locker key, there was no key. And I was like, well, what the heck? I, uh, I know that I had packages yesterday. Like I got the delivery um, notification from Amazon and the uh review prompts from whatnot so i knew i had stuff that was, had been delivered so i pull up into my carport and i had so much stuff that the mailman had taken all of my package out of the package locker and piled everything up by my front door y'all i had so many packages that the mailman couldn't even use the package lockers he had to leave them by the front door <laughs> he probably hates me. <laughs> I didn't count how many, but I, <laughs> I thought, um, oh my goodness, I am going to that. I'm going to come home one day and they're just going to stop putting my packages in the lockers and making me go to, um, the post office to pick my stuff up. Oh boy. All right. Let's get some light in here. I'm going to raise this up a little more. Yeah, I'm going to have to uh, make sure I do something. Whoopsie. Make sure I do something for my guy. Well, I'm already, I'm going to take a bunch of stuff into the post office too because they're always so good about, um, you know, scanning all my stuff in for me. And they let me borrow, um, they always let me borrow carts to take out to my car. They're just so great about that. So I want to do something special for them. Our mailman doesn't um, generally bring stuff up to the door unless um unless it's too big to fit in the locker or in cases like today where i have too much and they can't fit it all in the locker okay so we have our auction up we are going to start with uh crafters lots this is jewelry that is either earrings that are missing a partner, 
uh, pieces that may be missing a stone, they're broken, whatever the case may be, um, intended for crafts or repair or, you know, whatever it is that you want to do with them. There is, thank you for the follow, there is um, wearable jewelry um, a lot of times in with the crafters lots. Um, if there's, sometimes there's tangles and I don't, we don't want to deal with the tangles. Uh, we'll just take the whole big, huge ball of tangle jewelry and put it into the crafter's lot and we'll let, um, somebody else deal with that. So, all right. Are we ready? So, um, generally when I do, there is a description at the bottom that tells you about what's in them and how everything works. Uh, I'm build the lots on screen. I run the timer for five minutes just in case we get tangles or something. And, uh, sometimes it takes me the whole five minutes. And as we go along through the night, um, I usually will drop the time down a little bit depending on how we're doing. But generally, we start with five minutes for me to build the lots because we're building five pound lots and I want to show you guys everything that I'm putting in it so that you know exactly what's going in there. So let me get to the first box. We have approximately 40, 80, uh, let's see, 100. 120. I would say we probably have about 120 pounds of jewelry tonight. So we're going to do probably, we'll do the first few lots of crafters and then we're going to switch over to the wearable lots. Hey, Fiona. So we're going to set the timer. Five minutes. Starting the auction. Let's go. Let's bundle, baby. Okay, well, it looks like we're going to start off with a big, huge lot that's tangled here. I'm not going to try to tear this apart. This is, this is a, this is five pounds right here let's uh, start at one side so this is a big uh cross we're gonna kind of pick through a little bit and show you what's in here since i can't separate it this is one of those examples of five pounds of jewelry that we did not want to deal with separating Uh, there might be some rosaries in here. There's some necklaces and earrings. So this is one of the occasions where this five pound piece is so tangled that we just don't want to deal with it. But there's some really cute pieces in here for crafting. Some beautiful colors. Let's see what else we can find over here. So that is our first uh, five pound. Ooh, this is cute, actually. This looks like that might be a cute little necklace. Hopefully it's all in one piece in there. That would be nice. All right, let's see what else we can find. Well, here's uh, some earrings. A card of necklaces. Hey, Peach. How you doing, dear? Oh, this is brand new. I've had a few of these before and sold them decently. Uh, the shipping, you ne you never pay more than $8.35, and I use flat rate boxes. So once you hit the $8.35, it is never going to be more than that. And I use flat rate boxes. So this has one stone missing right here. 
So we're at five pounds, 12 ounces. Let's see what else we can get in here. I have put a bunch of uh, boxes together tonight. All right, things appear to be all wearable. We've got some bracelets in here. This is a JLo watch bracelet. See that right there? That is a JLo watch bracelet. More wearable. Looks like this last bundle that I just grabbed out is wearable. And this is six pounds, 13 ounces. So we almost got to seven pounds. And that is going to be our lot on this one. We have one minute and about 10 seconds left. And this is six pounds and 13 ounces worth of jewelry. Oh, that's cute. Little starfish. Generally, I can show you guys a little bit more of what's in here, but this one just happened to be one that was super tangled. So like I said, I try to um, show you guys what's in them. Upcycled assemblage is in at five with 20 seconds left. This looks really cute too. All right, Sugary Sunflower, thank you so much for your bid. And we are at $6 and we have five seconds left. Whoop. All right, another good lot. Six pounds, 13 ounces, just shy of seven pounds. Sugary Sunflower is in at 10 with five seconds left. All right, we have a lot, we have, oh my gosh, we have so much jewelry tonight, guys. I say that every night. We have so much jewelry every night. 15, oh, Mima, hey, how you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Sugary Sunflower has it at 19 with two seconds left. Sugary Sunflower, congratulations. Thank you so much for your first purchase with me. What a good get. Let's start a box up for you. So basically after you guys buy your first lot, you shouldn't have to pay for shipping anymore. So it's flat rate. You do that $8.95 and then, or $8.35 or whatever it is. And then um, the shipping's covered after that. All right. Woohoo! Here we go. I picked up um, about 120 pounds of jewelry today. Oh, yeah. So. It's a really good time. I have um I have regulars that come in every week and they they really really love going through their boxes. All right, y'all, let's get the next one going. Lot number 2. Let's see what we have in here. Here is a necklace from a new day. Handcrafted jewelry from Anjou. Some seed beads. Looks like there's some glass beads in here. Ooh, here's some nice acrylic beads. This is interesting. Look at this cool piece. Let's pull this out and look at it. Look at these. These are cool. I think this might be a full necklace. 
Not sure though. That's really neat. So I'm trying a new category tonight. We are in um, craft supplies. Usually I sell in storage units or um, estate sales because that's what I do. But I thought I'd try something different tonight. And there should be quite a bit of wearable jewelry in these as well. I don't guarantee it, but um, from what I understand, that people have been very, very happy with what they've been getting out of these. But we will move into throwing more wearable jewelry as I run out of uh, crafter's lot stuff. Okay. This is interesting. Um, a necklace that's still in the package. A felted flower. Uh, oh, that's a nice piece for decoration in a journal or something. Uh, this is, looks like a stainless steel um, bracelet. Doesn't appear to have anything wrong with it. We got here a, a watch. The band's a little worse for wear, but. Yeah, a little wallet. Here are some beads from a craft store still in the package Ooh, these are pretty i think these might be earrings that need hooks and it looks like it's signed they're signed as well hold on i'll take a peek and see what they are see if i can figure it out Let's, let's take a peek here, guys. Um, something craft. Holly craft. We'll put those back in here. were pretty oh. here is a bracelet trio doesn't appear to have anything wrong with it all right 38 seconds left and i'm at four pounds Here is a little uh, earring holder, 5.3 pounds. It looks like a little monkey and it holds earrings. It's a little earring stand, very cute. We're at 5.3 pounds. Uh, here is Row in the Shine Project, Sugary Sunflower. Congratulations. What a get. All right. Hey, old girl, grandma, how you doing? All right, our next lot is going. This is Mother of Pearl.
Little owl looks like he needs to be fixed. Here's a little jumble of chains in here that needs to be gone through. Very cute. All right. see here bracelet that's really cool hey blue mari how you doing let's see a bag of skull beads a couple of different colors of blue and some cream I think that's supposed to look like that. I think it's kind of supposed to look like a druzy. Those beads are really cool. I am taking this and I'm putting it in uh, sugar. I'm putting this in your box because I'm pretty sure there's a match to it in there. I do remember seeing that. See, this is all wearable, I believe. And look at these. Pretty sure these are glass. And there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, something from jewelry making? Some type of finding? Jewelry finding? Some bracelets. Another bracelet. And it appears to be, I think this is an anklet. Okay. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this. Twilight Eclipse, a Jacob book bracelet. Twilight fans out there? Oh my goodness. That is great. Some earrings still in the package. A bracelet. More bracelets. Pretty peach, thank you so much. We're at five pounds, 10 ounces. Let me see here. Do, do, do. This is, uh, is this marked? Doesn't appear to have anything wrong with it, but it does have a shepherd's hook clasp. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. And we are going to put the last little bit from this bag of bracelets in here. Ooh, that looks like adventuring or, well, I should turn my, all right, five pounds, 13 ounces. There we go. Sugary, thank you so much. Got good stuff tonight, y'all. Getting everything ready for the next lot. And sugary sunflower. Congratulations. Nice pickup. All right, all right. Let's get the next one rolling. All right. So here
here I'm going to show you an example of what's probably going to have some good jewelry in it, but we didn't feel like dealing with the tangle. Uh, there's a locket in here. There's a $38 ticket from Mac and me. Uh, Magnabilities. This looks like, what is this? Honestly, this is a beautiful piece right here. This is a vintage piece. And I want, what is this? This really looks like some of the uh, West German necklaces that I pulled out a while back. But this is a perfectly fine four-stranded necklace with a beautiful clasp. Very good one. Very good piece. We've got a wrap bracelet with a stone. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, oh, this pretty pink necklace. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Looks fine. Outside of a watch. Oh, some cherry earrings, star earrings. This is a bag of, we're going to pull this out. Hold on just a second. Some matching earrings in there. I'm going to show you one of these. This whole bag is filled with pins and you can put your own little charms or whatever from them. So that's that whole bag. And there are gold and silver tone in there. So if you're a jewelry maker, here is something that is going to be right up your alley. These are a bag of old school keychains. Remember these? Again, gold tone, silver tone. A whole bag. We are at three pounds with two minutes left. This is a ring. I think it's from Charming Charlie's bracelet. Bead. Something I can't see it. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, look at that. All right. Uh, feathered headbands. Pure Vita bag. Here is a bag full of like uh, pendants that you can put pictures and stuff in. We're at five pounds, eight ounces. Let's grab. All right, this is out of the wearable box. We have a beautiful little necklace and some bracelets. I think that's a premier design piece, actually, right there. And a beautiful bundle of uh, bracelets there. So that's going to give us six pounds in this box, guys. Six pounds of jewelry. Six pound crafters lot. Thank you all so much for your bids. I appreciate you. 
we have a lot more jewelry to go through tonight. Sugary Sunflower, congratulations! All right. Dun, dun, dun. All right. So this was the bottom of that other box that I couldn't grab with my fingers. So we've got, um, I'm going to go ahead and start the timer. We've got bracelets. We've got lots of beads in here. little wooden pumpkin I think this is a wearable bracelet I try to dump the bottom of the boxes all in together because if there happens to be matching earrings a lot of times they're going to be sitting on the bottom so I try not to uh, scrape the bottom of the box too much because if there's matches, I want you to, guys to be able to get the matches. All right, so I'm gonna pull out of the wearable box. We're gonna mix in a little bit of wearable. Here is a necklace. This is a beauty right here not sure if it's got any don't see any markings and they are tangled but hopefully you guys are buying this because you don't mind getting the tangles out beautiful green in here oh look at this one wow that is gorgeous Oh, and look at the, I think that's the chain for this one. Really beautiful. That is good. That is a good one. Look at the cute little elephant. Very nice. Let's see here. This is the tag on this one hey kendall we are doing crafters lots tonight all right this is pretty is it all here Oh, it's going to be a crafter's piece. You might be able to put a new clasp on that. Bracelets. Earrings. We are at five pounds, ten ounces with a little over a minute left. Here. Let's throw these uh, beautiful matching earrings in here. I'm going to stick those in a bag so that they won't get lost. You won't have to sort for them. They'll be in here. A little copper tone fashion ring. This is pretty. This is glass or ceramic. Love the color on that. Five pounds, 12 ounces. Let's do one more piece. We're going to do this bracelet. It is a fossil bracelet and this blue pendant. 
And that is going to top us off at five, uh, five pounds, 15 ounces, guys. Five pounds, 15 ounces. Uh, you know what? Let's throw one more in. Lulu Lollipop Pacifier Clip. If you have a, a kiddo that uses a pacifier, you'll be they'll be sucking their passy in style. I didn't realize they made pacifier jewelry. All right. We are down to 15 seconds. Cindy Taylor. Sugary Sunflower, congratulations. Let me get another box prepped for you here. Good, good one. All right. We are venturing into a brand new box of crafter stuff. So this is very interesting. Um, this is a dragon made out of beads. I've never seen anything like that before. Pretty cool. All right. Oh, this got stuck on my hand here. Excuse me, my nose is running, guys. Let me deal with this tangle here. All right. What is this? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, this lights up. It's like a, you can put something inside it and it lights up. You can see the LEDs in there a glass starfish, some beautiful beads and stones in here. We are at three pounds with about two minutes left. Let's see what do we have here. Generally, if they're bagged up like this, they're probably chains or necklaces. This looks like a locket. Uh, necklace. A cute little pair of earrings with googly eyes. Um, I'm not sure if this is a necklace or a keychain. This is a cross that has the Lord's Prayer in it. Oh, those are cute. Well, there's one. I don't know where the other one is, but that's cute. All right. Chico's. Chico's necklace. 
This is part of a belt and the other part is right here. We're at five pounds, five ounces with 155 left. Let me go over here and grab some bracelets to throw in there. Okay, a necklace that's still in the package. Great little Christmas present, stocking stuffer. These feel glass. Um, I think this might be glass as well. Um, not marked. Throw a few bracelets in there. That is going to put us at five pounds and 15 ounces with one minute left. And let's add one more bracelet in here. This is wearable. Hey, horsey, how you doing? We are doing some crafters lots tonight with wearable jewelry. These are gorgeous. All right, about 20 seconds left. Sugary Sunflower is in again. She's at nine. Throw some stuff in that fell out. All right, four, three, two, one. Sugary Sunflower, congratulations. Yeah, that one was almost six pounds. Okay. might drop down to four minutes yeah i do five to six pounds on oh there we go i do uh five to six pounds on crafters lots nights because i got to get rid of this stuff so it's not laying around the house anymore oh and i mean i wanted to change it and it didn't let me all right Oh, this is a, this is missing a few stones. It was a brooch pendant. There's some little uh, Mardi Gras beads in here. We are at one pound. Here's a bunch of earrings. This feels glass. All right, let me see here. Let's see. Here is a necklace still on the card and a tag along. Some bracelets. What is this? These are looks like uh, earrings or maybe oh they're all letters. It's like earrings with letters on them so you can mix and match and make them do initials and stuff. Earring pieces. And 
let's see necklace here is a wrap bracelet i love these wrap bracelets they're fun let's see here made in hong kong oh that's pretty earrings are missing but the necklace is cute we got a bracelet and this looks like glass probably a necklace and this is just a oh here we go it's like a little bib don't see anything wrong with it pretty peach thank you for bidding honey guy when i'm building these i don't really pay a lot of attention to the chat i, I do apologize for that everybody um i'm just trying to uh get some good jewelry in there for you this one's gonna have quite a bit of wearable in it i'm pulling from one of the other boxes right now usually if it's bagged up it's probably uh something that has been sorted out of my boxes and never run and i just never got around to it we're at four pounds seven ounces I always think these are really interesting. Oh, all the potential, absolutely. I think this is a hair clip of some kind. Oh, that wraps around your, like, your uh, loose bun. You wrap it around your bun. And so let's a little bit more in. We're at five pounds. Trying not to hit myself in the face with jewelry as I go along. Pretty little um, seed and shell necklace right there. Pretty Peach is in the lead with 16 or six, 20, 20 seconds left at $16. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. Here is a uh onyx and black and turk <laughs> tiger's eye it's uh necklaces and earrings a set of each so there's a pair of tiger's eye earrings and necklace and onyx earrings and necklace and that's going to be our last piece upcycled assemblage congratulations yay congrats on your first lot your first big bundle girl all right that's a good one too let me get your box labeled and ready Oh, it's going to be wonderful. Plus, you've got some wearable jewelry in there, too. All right. Uh, let me see. Where's my water? Where is my water? There it is. All right, had to grab my water and open my window, y'all. It's getting a little stuffy in here. Building these lots is a lot of work. All right. I'm 
going to get my hands loaded up so that I can be ready for this next lot. And we are going to try changing the time again. Okay. There we go. All right, we're going to drop it down a minute to four minutes. We've got some wooden beads. What is this? That's pretty. A little handful of Mardi Gras beads. Throw those in there. Some beautiful seed beads. We have a Nike watch band. Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh. What is this? Some bracelets. Here's another one of those uh, wrap bracelets with the uh, leather. Little flower bracelet. Peach, I know you like those wrap bracelets. Miss Jerry. Ooh, this is cool. Very interesting. Is that enamel? Cool looking chain. It almost feels like it should be marked. And there it is. Banana Republic. How you doing tonight, ma'am? Look at this corn necklace. Oh my gosh. It's a corn necklace. I have never, ever seen a corn necklace. Anybody else ever seen a corn necklace, corn on the cob? Well, there you go. That is new. Ooh, this is pretty. All right, I got a tangle. Bear with me for a second. All right. We have a corny uh, little choker. Here is a quartz necklace. This looks like a tangle we didn't want to deal with, guys. But there's some beautiful stuff in here. Look at these beads. And look at the look at the pendant on this. This is beautiful. Very nice. And then this is what I was trying to grab onto. Look at that. Hopefully the rest of the necklace is intact. But you could two two rings and put it on a new necklace. But this is beautiful. Look at that. Boy, there's some nice stuff in that one, y'all. Very nice. Here is a little pink pearl necklace in a little case. looks like a bag of earrings and that is going to put us over five pounds with nine seconds left woohoo yeah yeah sugary sunflower she's at 21 with four seconds left three two one cindy taylor good you guys gonna miss out on the corn necklace on the cob necklace. 
Cindy Taylor, congratulations. First win with me. What a, I mean, Cindy, you just won a corn necklace. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> the corn necklace. I mean, I'm pretty excited about that corn necklace. But seriously, though, there were some really, really beautiful um, glass beads and um, that one glass pendant in there. Absolutely stunning. Cindy, great pickup. Great pickup. Congratulations. <laughs> I love it. All right. Let's see here. I got a tangle. Let's get the next one going, my friends. Lot number nine. Dream. This is another big tangle that I think we did not want to deal with. Uh, so we just threw it in. If you like to detangle, you'll probably find some good jewelry in here. Because, like I said, if we don't feel like dealing with it, it goes into these. <gasps> Look at this. This is really pretty. I think those might be glass. All right, let's see what else I can find. Okay, we've got a tie chain, another one of those little cameo necklaces. A Ch uh, train charm bracelet. Here's a bunch of bracelets in here. Necklace. All right, two minutes left. We're at three pounds. How about we throw some packs of earrings in? Then these bags, there's a bunch of matched earrings. Some stuff from the craft stores to make earrings. Some hoops. All right, we'll start with earrings. There's quite a few earrings in there. Here is a butterfly necklace. Some navy beads. That's interesting. All these are necklaces, 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 more necklaces. We 
about ready to drop the box. Nine seconds, eight seconds left. We're at five pounds, three ounces. Upcycled assemblage. Throw a flower in there for you. All right. And a bride, there's a bride, rose gold bride headband in here. We're going to put that in there as well with those, all these beads. I'll let you untangle it. Cindy Taylor, thank you for your bid, hon. Appreciate you. Cindy Taylor, congratulations. Another awesome grab. All right. Gotta hydrate, guys. All right. Sorry, I'm trying to move my box. They are heavy. All right. Taking a quick breather here. Let's get going. Number 10 is running. This looks like it might be glass. A lace choker, I think. A flower. Some shells. Ow, that pinched me. It bit me little filigree butterfly this oh i thought that had a, ta a hang tag on it it does not it felt like it should All right. Anybody remember these? The satin beads, the thread covered beads. That one has a little stain on it, but I think you could probably get it off. Love these. Love those. Here's a pair of purple, like pom pom earrings. A box of magnets. I'm grabbing a handful of necklaces out of the wearables. This one has some charms on it and mushrooms. Look at the little mushrooms. And the an uh, elephant, hearts, flag. Looks like an interesting piece. Here's some wood and some metal. That one uh, necklace with all those charms on it looked really cool. This could be glass. It's hard to tell through the plastic. Some shell pieces. And a uh, multi-tone chain necklace with a knot in it. How about a... This. What is that? Monet, Monet bracelet. There's a little bit of scratch right here where the clip is, but other than that, it looks pretty good. Let's 
some enamel earrings. All right, we are at four pounds, 10 ounces with less than a minute left. All right, we have a golf bracelet. And here are some inlaid bracelets. What else do we have in here? A bunch of bracelets, charms, enamel. I think this is Alex and Ani. 13, 10 seconds left. Sugar Sunflower is winning. Five, four, three, two. Sugary Sunflower. There you go. Nice pickup. Very nice pickup. All right, hydrate time again for me. For some reason, this is running really slow tonight and I don't know why. I'm still here, guys. It's not letting me move on to the next one. Give me just a second. All right. Come on. So I heard that whatnot has been super glitchy today. Here we go. All right, Thrift and Gold, hey, hey. We're gonna start off with a grad necklace. Ooh, this looks good. This looks interesting as I'm dropping stuff all over the table. I think it needs a repair, but it looks pretty cool. How you doing tonight, Thrifton? We have another dragon made of beads, another dragon. Very interesting. Thrift and Gold, you missed the corn on the cob necklace. You missed out tonight. I think, well, there's a rosary with no cross. This blue one looks promising. Some beads. The beads, the beads, the beads. More crafting beads on a string. Got some flowers in here. We are at four pounds. What is this? Leather bracelet. All right. Handful of looks like mostly wearable bracelets. And 
a whole bunch of earrings. Earrings, earrings. Couldn't tie the knot without you. Card of earrings. Pretty peach, thank you for your bid, honey. Here are some uh, gauging pieces if you're a gauger or know somebody who gauges. There's a couple bags of those in there. Some more earrings. There was something in here that caught my eye. I don't know where it went. I was going to look at it, and I just disappeared on me. All right. Five, point, uh, five pounds, ten ounces, with 20 seconds left. Here we go. All right, my friends. Here are some more earrings that fell out of the bag. Little angel pin. Some more, these are like piercing holders for like noses and lips. Sugary Sunflower, congratulation. Gonna start a new bag for you. Sugary Sunflower, are you a, uh, are you a crafter? Crafter, reseller, I'm all good with it. That's why I sell the stuff the way I sell it. But if you're a seller on whatnot, I just followed you. Hopefully I can catch one of your shows. Hi, Mom. Cool. Well, I have lots of resellers that come in on my bundling shows to in my Thursday nights to pick up jewelry. So welcome to the family. These are cute. just going to put a whole bag. This is a bag of earrings in here. I don't know how many are in there. Oh, all right. My bad. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know, honey. <laughs> Kim Manel. Hey, how's it going? So I can slow down a little bit. Look at these gorgeous pink beads, these pink plastic beads, y'all. I think that... This needs a new clasp and a new ring, and that's still a good necklace. Or do whatever you want with it. Here is a little bundle, a bunch of little flowers. They are scarf clips, pins, whatever you want to do, lapel clips for your jacket. Art class necklaces. Oh, look at these. These are nice. So earrings. Ring adjusters. Some nice wooden beads. Premier Designs earrings. We are at two pounds, 12 ounces. I think this is another um, chain belt. 
No, I don't think so. This is actually a necklace. Lots and lots of beads in that one. This is a hair uh, decoration. Pin. A, oh, the back of the watch is missing. Another flower. All right, what's this? 140 left. Let me see what I can find. little bundle out of the bracelet box uh, looks like alex and ani again we're at five pounds ten ounces and i'm gonna go the last few bracelets from the bracelet box in there 51 seconds left we're at 515. I'm going to throw these cute little fish earrings in there. Because I think they're cute. Here are some pink beads and some green. And that is 515. Six pounds, one ounce on this lot, guys. Six pounds, one ounce. Three seconds left. Pretty Peach. She is in. She, I bet she wants those fish earrings. Congratulations, Peachy. Good grip. you very nice. Very nice. Thank you, ma'am. Woohoo! What a box. Yeah, was it the was it the blue fish that got you? <laughs> oh, that's okay. I know you're busy. Oh my gosh, what is that? As I was picking up the box, look at the little earring I just found. How cute is that? I hope there's a match in there. If there's no match, just take it and turn it into a pennant. The corn necklace was something else. That was a shame you missed that. I feel like if I would have saved the corn necklace and run it by itself, it probably would have done really well. Yeah, it was definitely the highlight of the night. All right, my friends. Okay, hold on. I got a, I got a low power notice. Let me plug this puppy in. All right, I got a... Got to drop down a little bit so my charger can reach.
Yep. Corn on the cob necklace. I think more than the highlight of the night, almost. All right. Let's get the next one going. We have a bunch of, there are some vintage pieces in here. Look at this cute brooch. Oh, it's the moon with an angel swinging. One of the little chains is off. I hope somebody can fix that. It's really cute. I'm so sorry. Yeah, they. I know they do, sweetheart. I know. I'm. We deal with that with my nephew. It can be so hard. Look at this cute bracelet, guys. It can definitely be tough. I understand that. I see my family going through it all the time with my little nephew. It's so hard. And, you know, some people just don't have any empathy for the kids either you know all right bottom of this box is getting dumped in all right we had emptied we've emptied three boxes so far tonight everybody three boxes Okay, here's a bunch of earrings. So we're going to be getting into almost all wearable jewelry now, guys. That is officially the last of what I call my crafters boxes, where I know it's a lot of broken jewelry. What I'm throwing in now should be mostly wearable. Look at these, all these pearl earrings. Their posts and there's every color of pearl earring how cute is that so this is all gonna be wearable or mostly wearable I should say that looks like a Chico's necklaces look at that it is acrylic with dried flowers in it a heart i don't think this is a locket though a navy blue I have oh you know what I have I have one more little crafters piece if you like to detangle actually I'm gonna save this for the next one because it weighs too much here's a gorgeous bracelet look at this beautiful bracelet Well, the next one is going to be for you then. This isn't. This one's entirely too heavy for me to add to this lot. All right, guys. These are all wearable necklaces. Kind of try to show you colors and stuff. And that's five points, uh, five pounds, six ounces. I was just going to keep adding in there. Sugary sunflower, thank you so much. What a great box. All right, guys, we're going to drop this next one way down on time. Uh, I'm going to weigh it real quick. 
Yeah, that's going to be five pounds. This next one's a doozy, and the whole tangle weighs five pounds. Yep, this next one is the uh, is the big one. This is going to be all a big tangle. Okay, let's pin this. It's going to be uh, busy for somebody. All right, we're going to drop this one down to one minute. Actually, we're going to do one minute and 30 seconds. We're going to start it. This tangle is five pounds. And this is all, look at this. All this is all tag jewelry. Chloe. Look at all this in here. This is all all these tags equals each one is one necklace. Here's a druzy in here. It is going to be a task for someone. But if you succeed, you're going to wind up with a lot of really great stuff. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I mean, that is, I hope that, I mean, these are the, the, the tags, 25, 25. This one's five. Doesn't have a tag on it. I hope, I hope that if you guys get this, that it works out, out well for you. There's some beautiful stuff in here. Sugary sunflower. Woo, you are a brave, brave person. I couldn't do it. I couldn't sit that long. I didn't even, you know what? I never even attempted this. I never even attempted it. I knew I wasn't going to be able to sit and do it. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Look at this. As I knock stuff around. I just see more stuff in here. Look at the dru this peacock looking druzy. And look at this cute little pendant right here with the flowers. Cute stuff. All right, sugary sunflower, in they go. Woo! All right, I think that's the last of my... Of <laughs> My mom will sit for hours and, and untangle and I can sort, but if it's too tangled, I just, I can't do it. I can't do it. Ooh, I just found another box. I just found another box. All right. Let me adjust the time again. All right, we're gonna go back up to three minutes this time. Okay, so if you're a pink lover, you're gonna love this lot. This is gonna be mostly wearable. Look at all this pink. I think there's a Barbie necklace in here. Maybe, is that a Barbie? I don't know what that is. Anyway, I think there's some pink and some red. This should all be wearable. If it's not like 99% of it, I think that's glass. Pink and red. Ooh. 
Ooh, look at that pink and orange. That is pretty. Look at that gorgeous enamel bracelet right there. It is a hinged clamper. Some earrings. More earrings. We are at 3.3 pounds. Some more red and some pink. All right, we are at 310 with one minute and 30 seconds left. All this stuff is going, goes into the flat rate boxes and the flat, the first, the flat rate boxes get lined with, um, trash bags, more earrings, the pearl necklace. And then I tape the boxes up, but I don't sort or wrap any of the individual jewelry. Necklaces, necklaces. What is this? That's pretty. Another necklace. 30 seconds left, we're at four pounds, five ounces. I have a thing of bracelets in here somewhere. I don't know where they went. Here are some more necklaces. Oh, look at that, that's cool. Got some more pink, some pearls, gold tone, sugary sunflower. Congratulations. All right, it is hydrate time. So that, um, that five pound tangle lot that sugary got, um, I've had that in here sitting here for like a month and every week I forget to pull it out and run it. Oh boy. All right. My legs starting to go numb a little bit. All right. Has anybody started cooking for Thanksgiving yet? I, uh, I volunteer at the American Legion every Thursday. And uh, so next week, uh, as usual, I'll be volunteering at the American Legion. But yeah, lots of people. Um, I think so. I think everything that's left is all wearable jewelry. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Yep. Oh my gosh, I just found another whole box of jewelry. Let's find another 40 pounds of jewelry here, guys. I'm cooking a bowl of cereal. All right. Let's see here. So let's start this one off. We're going to start with some shell necklaces. I'm going to be sitting for this one. Let's see, vintage. This is really neat. Check out the clasp on this. And then all the beads in here. Lovey, hello, my dear. How are you doing, my friend? This is going to be, this is going to be just about all wearable jewelry, guys. Uh, this is a multi-strand red, purple, and black, or red, blue, and black. This is kind of a cool uh, collar. Let's 
Oh, this, this red and purple piece is really cute too. Let me take it out so you can see it. Because I think it's gorgeous. Look at this. It's really pretty. It's kind of hard to see. I'm not really in the light here, but yeah, it's gorgeous. It's very pretty. Let's see here. Dun, dun, dun. Here's a bag with some watches in it. bracelets, necklaces. I love this green necklace right here. I think that's such a beauty. Got a little bit of color. That's a necklace. Some pink. More necklaces. A bag of earrings. I think there's 20 pairs of earrings in here. I'm not 100% sure. And let's get up to that five pounds. Here's some more necklaces in there for you. We're at five pounds, three ounces. Nate, how you doing? You Aren't you supposed to be on vacation? All right, guys. 20 seconds left or five pounds, three ounces. Let's throw another, I think this is glass. Let's throw another uh, handful in for good measure. And we are at five pounds, eight ounces of jewelry right now. Ken Manel, thank you for your bid. All right, guys, there we go. Five pounds, 10 ounces. Primarily wearable jewelry tonight. All of our crafters lots are pretty much gone. And we've got about 30 pounds of wearable jewelry left to get rid of. Pretty peach. Congratulations. Nice pickup. Very nice pickup. All right, you're so welcome. All right, give me just a second. I'm gonna grab a couple more things here. I do have another box of bracelets that I can grab as well. So let's give you guys a mixture tonight. We'll do earrings, uh, necklaces, and bracelets together. All right. Are we ready? All right, here we go. Next lot is going to run. Here is a bag of gauging pieces, ears, nose, whatever you want to ga gauge. There you go. There's some blue glass in here. Lots of necklaces. Gold tones. Necklace. Seed bead piece in here. Here are some bracelets. All right, we're under two minutes. Some filigree leaves for on a necklace. 
Um, I think this might be glass and not quite sure what kind of pendant we have there. This one is really pretty. We've got some pinks and some reds in there. That is a necklace. That looked like it might be vintage. Pearls. Here's some purples. A butterfly. An N. That's a cute little bracelet. Necklace. Here are some more bracelets. This one is glass. Beautiful color on that one. Okay, we're at three and a half pounds, so I'm going to start moving quicker. Four pounds, seven ounces. This is a bracelet charger for your phone. You charge it up, you wear it, and you always have a charger for your phone. Got that bag of watches in there already. Sugary, congratulations. And we're just gonna throw the rest of that in there for you. And that takes us up to five pounds, five ounces. Way to go. Sugary, if you could uh, take a look at your card, please. Stand by. Let me get this out of the way. All right. I think we have about uh, 40 pounds to go, guys. 40 pounds to go, I think. We'll figure it out. I'm going to try to get up to uh, six pounds on all these. All right, let me log this box real quick. And we'll get on to the next one. Let's go. All right. Do, do, do. Are you ready? Okay, we're going to start this bundle off with a handful of rings off of my ring tray. Maple, how you doing? A handful of bracelets. There's a paracord bracelet in there. And there's a pink paracord bracelet. Okay, this has some beautiful glass beads in it. It's like root beer. Really, really pretty. We've got some earrings from Maurice's. Thank you, Grinchy. I forgot to run it. I appreciate you. Y'all have to remind me sometimes. Uh, mesh chain necklace. <laughs> this one is really pretty. It has these pink looking cat eye pieces with the little like fakish opal definitely not real opal but it's really cool see we've got a rose gold i think it's a necklace rose gold tone here's a really cool uh bib another one with the beautiful color and reflection in that one there we go uh, let me see here. 
Here are some glass beaded bracelets. We're at one pound, 14 ounces. Here's another handful of bracelets in here. Let's see. We have a little elephant necklace. This big medallion with the um, stitching. I think that's a, a bracelet. All right. Got some black and silver. That might be glass. I'm not 100% sure. It's pretty, I think, or it has glass pieces in it, maybe. I feel a cool, I feel the coolness on my hands on that one. A seed bead bracelet with some pom poms. Ooh. A beautiful little necklace. Black necklace. I think this is a purple necklace with some matching earrings. There's some more bracelets. And we've got some beads, seed bead piece. I don't know what that is. And I think this might be my last bag of earrings. That puts us just over five pounds of jewelry, my friend. Just over five pounds. Let's throw this pretty little floral piece in there. Annie Banani, what's up? All right, we're gonna throw some more in for good measure. Take it up to five pounds, eight ounces. Pretty Peach, congratulations. Excellent pickup. Absolutely beautiful. Very nice. Very nice. Woohoo! Very, very, very good, my friend. Oh, that's a doozy. That's a doozy. Okay, so that gives us one, two, three, four, five boxes we've emptied tonight, guys. Five boxes we've emptied, and we have about three quarters of one to go, and um, about three one gallon bags of bracelets left. All right, I need to hydrate. Ooh. Give me just a second. Do, do, do. All right. Bracelets. I have three gallon bags of bracelets left. So, and I think I have about three lots left. So let's see what we can do here. We got a big old bundle of pearls. We've got, this is a really cool necklace that has a nice little fringe hanging down from the bottom of it. This I think is a slate necklace. Uh, I think this is a headpiece with like matching bracelet, but I'm not sure. Nope, you didn't even come close to buying all the bracelets, honey. Not even close. Let's see, what do we have here? Some type of star pin. 
let's see. We've got an old Spadell uh, watch band from back in the day. I think, I think this is, this is like, they're like metal pods of some kind. This has two iTech fitness trackers in it. Some red. Let me see here. I got a box sitting here. This is a Stella and Dot. There's some Stella and Dot uh, bracelets in here. It's a matching set. Pretty little uh, prism pendant. This is a Nine West silver plated bracelet. Some pretty blue. Got ourselves a beautiful piece of shell with some blue seed beads and blue painting on it. Here is a bundle of bracelets. And we are at three pounds with 46 seconds left. So I better get a move on. This is a bag of seed bead pieces. They're all in one bag together. I think that's another seed bead piece right there. More necklaces. Let's see. 20 seconds left. We are at almost five pounds. This is a bracelet made out of baseball leather. Here's some blue, here's some pins. We're at five pounds, three ounces. Here's a bouquet of earrings. Some glass, five pounds, eight ounces. A couple more necklaces. Some blue cat or pink cat eye. One more, Deb, congratulations. And thank you so much for your first purchase. What a pickup. Very nice. Man, that was a good one, Deb. Woo. Five pounds, 12 ounces of jewelry for $39. Shaz, are you in here? Can somebody tag Take Two Enterprises? Hold on, let me tag her and get her in here real quick. She messaged me and I can't, yeah, I can't, uh, I can't message her back right now. So I need her to come into the live so I can explain to her. One more, Deb. All right, hydrate, people, hydrate. Smoke them if you got them. We're going to take 30 seconds. All right. Are we ready for another one? We I think we have enough for two more, guys. I think we have enough for two more. All right. Here we go. We got a watch with a cork band. A uh, make your own bracelet deal. I think 
there might be some earrings and necklaces in here, some pins. There's some seed bead necklaces in here, a few handfuls, some earrings. It's going to rain here tonight, y'all. I love this necklace. It's got beautiful um, snake chains on it, a really gorgeous pendant. And I love this enamel pendant. This is a gorgeous necklace right here. Really, really stunning. I was surprised nobody picked that up at all this week. Amber seats in the package still. Let's see, a, a tin of wedding um, bands. This is a pair of earrings, a necklace, and a bracelet that all match. They're in here. Christmas piece necklace. A couple of handfuls of bracelets. Another paracord bait bracelet in there. This one's really pretty. Also, look at this gorgeous necklace right here. And this fantastic cuff bracelet. It's hinged. It's got a safety chain. Um, I don't think it was marked. But it's a very, very cool piece. We've got a lace choker with a rose on it. A couple of bracelets. So this is either a thing of watch bands or a thing of bracelets. I guess you could use it either way. Yep, tonight's mom's last night for a while, everybody. She's leaving for Tennessee in the morning. She might not be on for the next few nights. Here are some more earrings, bracelets, some old Spadel watch bands. Woo, I better hurry. Oh, lovey. Hold on. There we go. Five pounds. One more for good measure. Ooh, it's raining. I can smell the rain. All right, lovey. Let's put this beauty in. my last lot guys but it's going to be more than i'm just going to take everything that we have left and put it in here and i'm pretty sure i'm thinking it's going to be more than five or six pounds so this is going to be our last lot tonight i'm just looking around to make sure there's nothing else for me to grab Do, do, do. All right. Well, here we go. This is going to be our last one. Here is a chakra, uh, gem, sterling silver and genuine gemstone bracelet, seven chakras. 
a bag of the last of the bracelets. And now I'm going to pile in the last of the jewelry. Here's a box with Avon in it. Here's some Lily Lynn earrings. A keychain. This is a Christmas uh, necklace with changeable um, pendants. There's some watch bands, some bracelets, some necklaces. Look, a chili necklace. Some Halloween stuff in here. More necklaces. Some hair pieces. Some leather, faux leather bracelets. Oh, there's a watch. This is a watch. Some more uh, vintage Spadell watch bands. Uh, this is a Christian Siriano pair of earrings. We have some more Avon in here. Bracelets and earrings. We're at three pounds. Necklaces. Here is a bracelet and ring that matches that choker that's down in there somewhere. Some necklaces, some earrings. We're at five pounds. Some more necklaces, earrings. Look at these cute little angel earrings. Last box of the night, wearable jewelry, Sparta pewter. Uh, these are Marine Corps uh, pendants. There's uh, a couple of them in here. Hey, hey, the last lot of the night, honey. Last lot of the night. 14 seconds left, we are at the bottom of the box. We are at six pounds, three ounces. Let's throw in, what do we got here? I think that's it. I think I just about gave you everything I got tonight. One, lovey. Oh my goodness. Holy smokes. You guys killed it tonight. You guys killed it tonight. Hold on just a second. We did. Let me see. Let me if I need to. I'm going to add this up real quick and let you know how much how much jewelry we did tonight. Because I think it might be a record. I'm waiting for it to update. Do do do. We did a lot of jewelry tonight, guys. How much jewelry do you think we uh, boxed up tonight, everybody? If you had to guess, how much jewelry did you guys see go by tonight? Every lot was between five and six pounds. 135. Peach says 135. I think it's probably a pretty good guess. Bear with me for just a second. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get Lovey's box out of the way and then we'll add it all up. Lovey! You y'all gonna make me work hard on the way to the post office tomorrow. Man. Let's see here. Do, do, do. Okay. 
We did about 130 pounds tonight. I'll have to, uh, once I weigh everybody up for sure, I will, um, I'll get a, I'll get an exact number because I, I weigh everything and track it every week so that I know how much we're going through. But I think it was about 130 pounds tonight. I was hoping to hit 150, but um, maybe next time. Eventually, I want to have a night where we do 200 pounds of jewelry. And I'm actually thinking, so I buy my jewelry boxes um, unsorted in 30 and 40 pound um, boxes. I was wondering if you guys would be interested in me running um, the unsorted jewelry out of them. So it would be us building lots out of the unsorted jewelry, but the, um, the starts are going to probably be a little bit higher. So if you think you might want to get some unsorted jewelry, let me know and we'll, uh, we'll figure something out. So anyway, anyway, you guys rock. I don't have anything scheduled for tomorrow night, but I am going to pop up sometime in the evening, probably around 630 my normal time, because I am doing the Tweet Co challenge where you do a minimum of 30 lives and 30 days that are 30 minutes long. Um, so I want to try to hit that. I do have some new jewelry to show you guys tomorrow. So I'm excited about that. And, um, oh, I have some new sterling as well. So tomorrow night, we're not going to start off as a bundling night because I have some beautiful new sterling pieces to show you. Um, but we may, we, you know, we may wind up going into the bundling if you guys are interested. As always, thank you so much for blessing me. And I appreciate you guys every night you come in here. You just don't even know um, the joy that I have from being on whatnot and having you guys come in and see me. Um, and that's why I'm so generous and I, I give you guys extras when I can. Um, I appreciate you guys so much. Uh, now let's go bless somebody like you've blessed me tonight. Uh, we have some amazing folks on. So um, let's see who's on that we can go hang out with. Um, anything's possible is on and she's only got five viewers. So let's go over and hang out with her for a little bit. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate you. And uh, we will see you uh, tomorrow. Much love, blessings. Let's go 